The marriage of cigarettes and coffee is such a perfect one, if you think about it. One so age-old, so time-honored, so damn glamorous. You could be daring and add a donut. Typical New York affair, really. And so was it appropriate that I should be partaking in this beautiful pairing, the staple of cops and journalism, when I found out that I was to die. I, the journalist, was dying. Words as familiar as they are to me could not sound more foreign. Ironically, if you experience something traumatic, you are supposed to be lost for words. But here I am talking of donuts. I realised that I had been poisoned, having discovered the remnants of a pill on the cup. I put the time of death at approximately 10 hours from now. This is it. I have 10 hours to live. At first, my mind was a tempest of mixed emotions, but now a sea of calm clarity has descended, washing my slate clean. They are both of utmost importance. This is clear to me. I have 10 hours to solve my own murder, and 10 hours to atone, wash my sins away. My dame had a past, and I am a hero. Flawed at that, with no future. Here I am, cigarettes in hand, coffee and desk, donut abandoned. All I need is a femme fatale, and my life could be double indemnity. Hmm. So 10 hours, 600 minutes, 36,000 seconds, 35, 34, 33. This is it.